Welcome to Pacific Partnership 2012. I'm Senior Chief Poe and I'll be your host of How Do They Do It? It's going to be a series of question and answer sessions that will explain how it gets done on board the USNS Mercy. On my first episode, I'll be taking a question from one of our Partner Nation crew members. G'day, I'm Sapper Wetton from the Royal Australian Engineers. We're off the coast of Vietnam and what I want to know is, how do you get a floating hospital to travel 20,000 miles? That was an excellent question. So let's hear one from one of our subject matter experts. Hi, I'm Spencer Pierce, third engineer, here to explain how we move a hospital ship for Pacific Partnership 2012. Uh, we boil water in two boilers. Uh, water makes steam. Steam goes to power a set of turbines that spin really fast. The turbine speed is slowed down through a reduction gear system uh, to go to the shaft speed. The shaft uh, drives the propeller of which uh, the propeller generates thrust. Uh, the thrust is transmitted to the ship via a thrust bearing. And uh, thrust bearing will push the ship forward or aft. Uh, after we use the steam uh, through the turbines, it goes into the condenser. The condenser uh, cools off the, the steam, condenses it back into a liquid, and the liquid is pumped back into uh, the, the boilers essentially to be used again and reboiled. That's how we move a hospital 20,000 miles for Pacific Partnership 2012. And that's how it gets done. And if you don't know, ask Senior Poe.